Hey there folks, and welcome back to Europa Universe Silence for the Rights of Man expansion as Austria. So in the last episode, uh, you know, we're, we're in a war with the Ottomans and France joins in. As, as usual. Uh, as it turns out, I mean, currently, you know, the numbers say that we're ahead. Um, but, you know, sometimes the numbers can lie. <laughs> sometimes the numbers can lie. Fortunately... Uh, the Ottomans' war exhaustion is getting high, and their war enthusiasm is getting low, so those are pluses. Yeah, we're, we're not going to be able to hurt France here, and got a Bourgon Falls. 37 development, jeez. You, you guys have just been going crazy with your capitals, haven't you? A mere six. How many times has this been approved? Thirteen. Th 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 thirteen. To be fair, I've improved Vienna seven. So, you know. There's been some improvement going on. Oh, but still. But still. Alright, let's move over here. Has Bosnia been completely looted? Not yet. Not yet. Um, I'm gonna hire another Merc. Just cause just to try to siege down some of this stuff and try to bring their war exhaustion up. God, do I... How much is it going to help me if I get rid of 2% of that siege ability malice? I mean, the manpower recovery speed is... I mean, it's something. I do need... I do need mans. I do need all every man's I can get. Uh, do, 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 do. I also need Diplo points, though. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. That'll slightly increase. Yeah, that will slightly increase our uh, income. It'll also help with our siege ability. All right, let's let things run on just a little bit. Poland no longer hates Russia. Hey, Burgundy. Okay, is Poland not big enough to hate Russia? Is that is that what's going on there? France is now second in terms of great powers. Okay, all right. Uh, we're getting to the point where we're close to be to jumping Ming, which is, which is something. Something indeed. Uh, no Venice, uh, Masovia, no thank you. Silesia, no thank you. Wurttemberg, no thank you. Speed is concession, yeah. I don't really care about getting on those various thrones. I mean, Naples, possible. I mean, it wouldn't be the worst. Ah, eh. rifle defensive. Ah, eh, it'd still be too much work. Might as well just take them over. There is still a bit of a question about whether I'm actually going to be able to take land from the Ottomans, but at this point, I kind of think that maybe I can't... Holy crap, France! Why are you so France? Jeez. Right, the Golden Horde is... Oh, right, yeah. They still do well on flat terrain, but they're just not... Yeah, they're... They're not a match for the Ottomans. Gee, that's... That's not even fair. Is 14 a tactics level? No. Jeez. Alright. 15 is, though, so we need to make sure we don't, uh... We don't fall behind. Alright, so there's some battles going on up here. Arrived in Bosnia, join them together. 41 days. Just wow. Just, just wow. 
heading to Wallace. I mean, I don't know if they're if Burgundy's trying to wrap around and head over there. Maybe. Because the Platinum's in this war, right? Maybe the Platinum will join up with them and, you know, try to make something happen. I don't know. I don't know. Meanwhile, yeah, we're going to try to deal with this, this stack from Tunis. I wish they'd die a little faster. I do. I do. All right, you head down this way. They're going to come and reinforce. That will be all right, I suppose. I'm going to finish out the month there. Just to get that loot. That rich, delicious, juicy loot. Yeah, there's basically no loot left to get from Serbia. God, money. Money is a bit of an issue. He says, drastically understating things. Alright, let's dive. I still don't understand why we were the attacker there. But, you know, I assume it's all on the up and up, right? Wait. Oh, it's farmlands. With no river. Oh, that's why they're diving. Okay. Well, in that case, 13th, they're going to get away on the 14th. We'll arrive on the 14th as well. Okay. That seems fine. We'll arrive on the 30th. All right, well, you can't always get what you want. Up to 11. Ongoing battles. Oh, right. I can tell you how that one's going to end. The Ottomans are going to win. That may just be, be, be me being sour. Who can say? Alright, come on, Serbia. Fall. Fall, Serbia. Did he say something about Serbia in the fall? Yes, yes he did. What the hell? What the hell? No, seriously, Bohemia, what the hell? <sighs> Alright, Tarnovo is also flat. There is a river, however. One maneuver versus three, so we would have a minus one. They have slightly more cannons. I don't know what Bohemia is doing. I don't understand. I kind of don't want to dive. Because I don't know if they're going to turn around. I don't know what Trier is doing either. Alright. So there's 40... Call it 65. So that's 115,000 Ottoman troops that we can account for. It's basically the entirety of their army. Basically. When would we get there? On the 24th. We'll get there on the 21st. Are you going to come with, Hungary? Alright, fine. I'll just turn around too. That's no big. Doesn't bother me at all. Not even a little bit. I swear to dog. I swear to dog. Come on, Bohemia. You can do this.
you can do this without being an idiot. I know you can. I have faith in you. It's my first mistake. It's my first mistake. I... I'm confused. How oh, good a disease outbreak. That, that makes me happy. Thirteenth, so that'll be basically a week. Yeah. Bohemia, what, what the hell, man? No, seriously, what in the actual factual are you doing? Really, they chose that fight. The Ottomans chose that fight. It did not go well for them. Unfortunately, that probably means they're going to run back to uh, Constantinople and we're going to have an issue. Oh, wow. I... I was expecting a much more hard-fought battle, if I'm honest. Like, far, far, far more hard. Okay. Let's stack and move them there. Yeah, I don't want to get too spread out. Like I say. Well, then again. No, no. I don't know when Serbia is actually going to fall. You know what? I'll risk it. Oh! Good of you to come help, Bohemia. Good of you to come help. Ravage Govitzed. Stack wiped some troops. Good deal. Alright. Are they murking up? Is that what's going on here? Macedonia. I don't know if they're gonna keep her running that way or what. So there's also some uh, fort stuff going on here. I have siege. Does this guy have siege? No. Alright. Fair enough then. <laughs> hey, we've reached a wall, so that's that's positive. All right, 20, 25, 30. So let's claim Treviso. And let's buy on someone else or use that diplomat for something else in general. Yeah, you know what, I'll leave him there for now. It's fine. All right, they're heading down to Thessaly. I'm trying to deal with some of their reinforcements, hoping that it's going to be vaguely meaningful. Hey, good. I mean, Burgundy's going to lose that fight, probably, but it means they're not going to lose Borgon right now, and that's going to be massively helpful. Alright, so I was looking at a peace offer. They would, they would take a white piece. Now, we don't have enough war score to take anything yet, but we could take the war goal right now. Uh, I was looking at giving Russia something. 12, 11, 12. 19% war contribution? Ugh. So, I don't know. We'll see. We may have to screw them over again. I don't know. Sure. Sure. Thank you, Mamlux. I am glad to have your loan. Right. Alright, 
I'm a little concerned about the stack that went down this way, but I figure if we can control this space, we can maybe be sort of, uh, sort of protected by Russia, kind of, sort of, not really. I don't think Russia's actually in that good a shape, realistically. Deal. Ooh, stack wipe on 12,000. Not bad. Not bad at all. Five, six. Six, alright. We're getting close. We're getting close to having their numbers down near. Oh, oh, that's. That's not ideal. I don't think I can get back there at a meaningful time frame, but. Give it a shot. Yeah, that's gonna go poorly when France reinforces. Still, though, still, Burgundy held their own. I bet it's though Bourgogne did not get siege down just quite yet. Just quite yet. Actually move there, that will be fine. Yeah, okay, they broke. You head that way. Head to Travunia. Serbia's woods, right? But there's a fort that we control. So I assume that we would be alright if we need to fight there. I guess I actually had to Vidden. Kind of wrap around that way. Good deal. Good deal. All right, we're blocked from getting there by uh, Fort Turkovitz, which is fine. Which is fine. All right, Sophia is woods, can hold how many? 26. All right. Ah, good. Ah, good. I could hire that general now, but I'm going to give it just a little while. Wow, we have a lot of uh, cost reduction there, don't we? Indeed. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Let's see. And let's say. Right there. Right, let's say. Spend some points there. Take back Travunia, which seems like an odd choice, but whatever works for him. 1121 one, is not a very good leader, but. Alright, let's take. This guy, the leader, and move him. There, excuse me. Let's take this leader, move him there. Have things somewhat more reasonable. Ah, uh, we've stopped collecting war taxes. How much longer is this war going to go on? Yeah, that depends on what we can do with France, really. I think we're I think we've successfully turned the tide on the Ottomans. But I mean God, this is like twenty development over here. It's nineteen, yeah. Uh the 
it's a question of, eh, you know what, it's going to be fine. I'll pay for it. Notice how I notice how I say that confidently and then doubt myself. Yeah, I'll pay for it. It will be fine. Deal. Ooh, it's an obsolete fort for us. Good, good. Thirty-six percent sounds pretty, pretty good. Boy, can I work that in any way by them splitting their stacks? I don't think I can. Uh, jazz, out of curiosity, like you're on tech eleven militarily with Muslim units and no combat bonuses whatsoever. Interesting. Interesting. And by interesting, I mean, uh, well, uh. I mean, how about them troops, man? How about them troops? Ooh, yeah, these, these guys are not looking good. Z. Alright, detach the mercs. Grab the ones that aren't mercs. Whew. Consolidate them. Join all of that together. Z. Let's do the same thing. Hire some more mercs. Some of them were uh, were locked heading to Macedonia, which is flat. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's dive. Actually, let's bring you down to Plovdiv. I think we're pretty okay. Yeah. I'm a little worried about that. Seventh the fight will happen on the fourth. All right. Plovdiv. Oh. Oh, heh heh, heh heh heh, about that, uh, see I was kidding, I was kidding about that whole fight thing, I was just, yeah, alright, well, something about hubris, something about hubris, something about Olivia whose name is hubris. All right, all we have to do is get, like, another fort. All right, if they can stop the Ottomans from taking back Ostrakhan, that'll be nice. But more importantly, if they can take Crimea. God, the Ottomans just have so much defensiveness. Being pious is a big freaking deal. Also being lucky, to be fair. Also being lucky. That's not bad, dot JPEG. For now, I'm just going to move the mercs around to uh, various locales. That's right, I need to bring that army down as well. Hey, good deal. To Tarnovo. I guess I had to Celestria. And also had to Tarnovo. Oh, did they. Did they decide not to join up? Seems they did. Okay. All right. Good. Good. Hmm. Can we march on the capital? Let's find out. Let's find out. All right, they're heading to Plovdiv.
Kinda wish. Are they both locked? Yeah, they're both locked. Alright, fair enough. Call that diplomat. Uh, let's see. Is it time? No, not for ten more years. Okay. Good, good, good deal. Alright. Alright, well, if they're going to come attack me... Either way, I think I will be okay. There's still that 40 stack over there somewhere. Bun wants to give us troops. Sure. They're awful, but sure. Oh, this worries me. This worries me. Greatly miss his attention to their health. Okay, I guess that was the, I guess that was Baden's general. So it's kind of an occupation. Oh my, oh my. Yeah, we did a number on them, and now we're being attacked. It's weird to me how we seem to be doing Seems like we... No, okay, alright. I was going to say, it seems like we were doing better on the offensive, but I guess it was also against uh, Jazz, to be fair. To be fair. Alright, send them to Constantinople. Send... Alright, you stay. You head to Adirn. You head over there. Good deal. Alright, folks. Well, let it rock on for a day or two. Eleven percent. We're at eleven percent. Will they? Ooh, they would take that peace deal. They would take that peace deal. All right. Let me. Four days. I mean, it's France. They're gonna. They're gonna take it at twenty-one percent. I'm pretty sure. Russia's not close at twenty-eight percent. I mean, I can let the war go on. And, you know, if we cede down Constantinople, that's going to be, you know, a big deal. But no, I think losing these two is just going to be too big of an issue. That It's going to take us a long time. We're already deep in a manpower hole. Can I take anything else? Can't take that. Can't take that. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're too far over score, I think, at that point. Like, yeah, even that is just not going to fly. So, it's not going to be much in the way of power projection, to be fair. But it is still a victory. We still have beaten them, and we still... You know, we can start claiming more of their land now. Yeah, I think I think this peace deal is going to be good for us. Part of me wants to keep fighting, but I don't think it's the right idea. So, yep, send demand. Can't go back. Good deal. All right, folks, I am going to call this 
an episode. I thank you folks for watching, and I hope to see you next time where, yeah, fallout from the war. Yeah. See you then.